Hi there, fellow restaurant owners and chefs. It's Master Chef Red Knight here with an awesome video for Food Street. That's right, everybody. We are playing Food Street. One more order there, as you can see, for my gumball machine, and then I can think about upgrading it. I can also get my ice cream machine going there, and in another 10 hours on that one, I will be able to get my little reward. I've got my two brand new unicorn pets there. The white one will be staying, but the rainbow, the gumball machine, and the ice cream stand will be disappearing. Hearing. So if you want to get them, make sure you do so soon, because they will vanish, because the event is almost over. Right, now, when it comes to this video today, my main focus is all about milestone number two, and we are about to get that. So at 400 points, we get the red box, we claim our prizes, and bang, there it goes. We got a blue voucher and a gold voucher for my collection. Yeah, 26 and one blue, and look at that. Recipe upgrades, extra event plots, and an extra slot. Now, the extra slots and the event plots are fantastic. They're really useful, but that's not the best thing about milestone number two. Milestone number two is all about speed, everybody. That's right. Speed within the event is really, really important. And if you can actually upgrade your recipes to produce a lot faster, then it's going to be much, much better. Now, you can see here the extra points that we get for the actual milestone number one. Now we can start getting more points for milestone number two, which is fantastic. But as I said, it's not really getting points this time. It's more about producing faster so you can then get those points a lot quicker. Now, you'll see here you've actually got the chance to get the second heart, and the second heart is speed. First heart for milestone number one, points. Second heart, speed. The actual third heart is also points as well, but number two here is the critical one, as you can see. That allows you to actually speed up your recipes, produce them faster, thus allowing you to actually get more. Now, to do this, you might find that you need to add more slots. Now, that's the great thing about milestone number two as well. It allows you to unlock another production slot for your machine. So, in addition to the three that you may already have, you can now get number four so or even number five depending on the actual machine itself now the candy merchant go for it maximize all of those slots it's really really important but look at that everybody 40 percent there whoa that is super cool and for those actual items there you do want to speed them up i found that the actual candy merchant was a bottleneck to be able to make those faster and to have the extra slots totally required within the game now, I did enjoy the event, as you know. I was able to build this final plot here, which I did do. I had all nine plots. I was able to speed up my recipes and get a lot of points for my actual team. Now, I'm not the most active player, but I did do my fair share, and we were happy enough to come in the top three. So we were kind of pleased about that. Now, if you are going to need more tokens to actually upgrade, well, you can get them in that prize tent. Now, do check out my prize tent video because I explain more about getting those tokens there. Basically, you're going to need those blue vouchers. So, to get those vouchers, you need to start making more and more orders. And the same with the chef's challenge. Do that chef's challenge and maybe you'll get the blues as well. Now, I do wish we could actually get blues for doing trucks or for other regular activities because I think blue vouchers are going to be a critical element as we now progress within the game called Food Street. Now, I was really, really happy with the way I progressed and it basically went really, really well for me. I think upgrading almost all of my machines to just produce faster. Now, I didn't really do the third one for everything, but that second speed option really, really made a difference. And it could be just seconds, but when the clock's ticking down and you've got that beautiful golden order and you want to get it done and it's like a hundred points or 120 points you've only got seconds left to get it done and that speed it up moment really really did help so remember everybody milestone number two that's the one you want to be aiming for the first one's fantastic points the second one is the one that allows you to speed up a lot quicker Right, now, you're just seeing me here just doing what I usually do. I'm going to sign off now, and I will see you all in the next game. So, good luck with your future events, and enjoy cooking, everybody. It's Red Knight here signing off. Don't forget to follow, like, subscribe, share, and tell all of your friends about this awesome game called Food Stream. See y'all, and have fun in the kitchen.